Good morning, afternoon, whenever you're watching this. Thank you for watching. Um, today is Wednesday and we are getting back in the groove of things. Y'all know that I was out of town for about two weeks, two weekends or whatever. Came back in town trying to get settled back in. Um, so we already went grocery shopping, stacked up everything. Uh, what else did I do? Hmm. I don't know, I did some other stuff. But this morning I got up and like just vacuumed and cleaned my bedroom. Again, like I changed out my bed sheets and, uh, and I vacuumed or whatnot. Because not that it needed it, but I just felt like I needed a change. So... I put on some new bed sheets. Hopefully it's gonna keep me cooler at night. And I mean, after doing all that, I just feel like I need to vacuum. But anywho, we are going to the gym today. Yes, Lord. Um, my friend Alina that y'all saw in a, another in a previous vlog from New York, she basically kind of like challenged each other. We're like very competitive. Hey, so like we're very competitive or whatever. So she already be like, yo, we need to get back on this working out. Oh, we're not been outside too much and not and not doing what we need to do. So today is all about getting back on track and getting in the routine of things. So I feel like if my house is clean, I will feel better, especially just walking into my house or whatnot. Um, so then everything else today is the things that we do and consume. So we are starting off today with some greens. Don't worry about the bottle. It ain't aesthetically pleasing, but it is greens in that. Let, actually, let me just show y'all what, what's in it. Put a scoop of super greens in here and then a scoop of L-glutamine and that with some... I did that with some cold water. Now we're making breakfast because I'm about to go work out with one of my friends. If y'all see before or been here for quite some time, y'all know that I work out at home in my gym or I go to um, a park or trailer or whatever to run. But today I'm gonna switch it up. I'm gonna go to the gym. I'm gonna meet up with my friend. She literally works out, so she's going to challenge me, and I feel like that's what I need to get back into this whole routine or whatever. I worked out two days already this week. Today will be number three. If I survive this, if I survive today, one working out, three days in a row, and then two working out with her, oh, I'm back, baby. I'm back. <coughs> Ooh. <coughs> so anyway, she told me yesterday, yo, make sure that you eat. Oh, um, a big breakfast and then take like a protein shake or something before you go to the gym. 
I have not found like a vegan protein or a protein that's not so bad. Oh, I'm so lying. I'm lying. I'm lying. Protein. I'll drink this on the way to the gym. I just forgot about that so much. So right now I'm just making breakfast. Um, I'm going to drink my green juice and take my vitamins that y'all know I do every day. And we're going to get back to work because we had already started working. So, welcome to the vlog. Y'all know I swear by these, baby. All right. This morning I'm, at, I'm also going to take morning moringa I will hopefully if it's flipped around I'll, I'll flip it around but I'm going to take two of those it looks like this same size as my happy flow um so if you don't know moringa is good to uh detoxify the body It is considered a superfood and what this says is that moringa equips the body with all essential nutrients providing total body wellness um actually you know what i'm only gonna take one because my super greens that i am drinking has moringa splenda and all these other things and the super greens which i should have told y'all earlier um again it's a superfood same thing, superfood, superfood. Woo, okay y'all, so we're done with that. I need to wash dishes a little, but in the meantime, my breakfast was actually done. I am eating on a paper plate. So I got French toast sticks. These are Co Cody cakes of these right here. These Cody cakes, uh, French toast sticks. Man, the French toast sticks taste better than the waffles, but the waffles not bad. Um, <clears throat> although, although this has soy, although it has soy, when I want to eat something like this, these are the best ones in my opinion, because it has less ingredients and the taste is not bad, especially if you put it in the air fryer. So, um, the Cody cakes, if you do a serving of four, you have 10 grams of protein. I actually only eat three. So I like to eat the Cody cakes or whatever, but but because I know it has soy, I try to limit the amount that I eat at one time. So I have the Cody cakes that you guys saw, and then I have these chicken breakfast um, patties. These are from Trader Joe's, and it, this has nothing bad in it. It's chicken and basically seasoned. One of those, and then I'm gonna put some fruit with it, strawberries, and some grapes. Look at her, a little, little, little some, some. I really feel like this is not gonna hold me over for um until I go to the gym. So if it doesn't. So if it doesn't hold me over and I feel like I need more food, I'm going to just make some oatmeal, like a really small, small bowl of oatmeal overnight. And then that will be breakfast. So, yeah. Oh, I had this cantaloupe. I need to cut that up. Let me cut this cantaloupe up real quick.
Okay, guys, we made it to the gym. Y'all, we just walked in here and I'm getting reprimanded already because I didn't do a warm up. She's about to kill me. Hey y'all, it's Editing Tempest here and I wanted to go over a little bit more into the superfood that I didn't talk about earlier. Okay, so long explanation short, a superfood is a nutrient-filled food that your body basically needs for health and wellness. So anything that's packed with vitamins and nutrients that you need. So like if someone says, oh, you're sick or whatever, they're most likely or going to tell you to eat something that's healthy is going to make you feel better. Superfoods can help reduce the risk of chronic diseases, overall health, wellness, and support um, certain body bodily functions. In our case with fibroids, so some of those foods are like your green tea, berries, leafy greens, onions, um, uh, avocados, turmeric, things that are going to be anti-inflammatory, ginger, y'all, y'all will see me, I always get ginger or whatnot, um, and maybe not, but from time to time I eat ginger whole, so, yo, those are just some examples of some foods, um, that are quote-unquote superfoods, so, okay, thank you for watching, bye!